Le Kuang Liam wrapped up Jib Chess at 7 out of 10. He joins us in our studio. Liam, a very interesting game with the white pieces. You took your chances. Tell us about the critical moments. Yeah, I think today's game went quite smoothly for me. Um, after the opening, I was very happy with my position. Um, I was a little surprised when he played this move C5 that allowed me to um, close the center with D5 and then I had a very nice square for my knight on C4. I think it's strategically winning for white because all my pieces are very nicely placed and I have attacking chances um, on the king side. However, later on, I um, at the critical moment, I think was after I played e5, de, knight takes e5, rook d6. And I I was sure there's a win, but I couldn't fight it. And I spent a lot of time. And finally, I decided to play knight ec4, which still gave me a very good advantage. But um, knight e4 would be the crushing move. And <laughs> it's a pity that I missed that move. You had a tough day yesterday. How did you deal with that to come back strong today? Yesterday was a big disappointment for me when I lost in a very promising position against Yu Yangyi. Um, I guess I was just too optimistic um, in the middle game and instead of playing it safely, I decided to take my chances and it didn't work out well. Um, so I thought, okay, uh, that game is gone. <laughs> I just have to focus on the last game and Okay, um, I won't be able to get uh, to fight for the first prize, but um, let's hope that I can gain some ratings, maybe get some prize. So, yeah, just try to, to enjoy the game today. It's a good approach. Apart from yesterday's disappointment, overall happy with your play? Yes, I think this year I play a very decent chess. Um, I score half a point less than last year, but still I gain some rating points. So it's, um, it's not too bad for me. And what are your upcoming plans? Uh, my next tournament will be the Spring Classic in St. Louis uh, in March, and then um, probably some other open tournaments. And have you been following the top board games today? Of course, um, all the games are very, very exciting and surprising. <laughs> I couldn't expect um, Maxime to get a losing position. I don't know if he can hone this, but it looks a little difficult for him. Also, Levon, um, I don't know why he sucked the piece after the opening. But yeah, I mean, they probably were over pushing. And, uh, but okay, at Team EF, he, he, he played really well, and I really expect him to win this tournament. Definitely, he deserves it after his play here. Thank you for joining us and enjoy the evening. Thank you very much.